Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at a CMMG Banshee called the MK17. It's a new release that's chambered in 9mm. I've taken it to the range already, I've put a lot of rounds through it. Let's go ahead and roll through some of that footage and we'll come back and talk more about this pistol. Today we're looking at a new release from CMMG called the Banshee MK17. I'm a huge Banshee fan. I've got the 5.7 by 28 millimeter and a Banshee 300 blackout. This one's chambered in 9 millimeter. It's called the MK17 and what makes this unique is that it accepts Sig Sauer P320 mags. Now the expanding Sig Sauer line of 320 handguns offers so many. It's become extremely popular and many people have these mags the mk17 will accept them now we know that many of the banshee models take glock mags this one here takes six hour p320 mags and i'm super excited because i think a lot of people like mags that are interchangeable it's an ar pistol this one has an eight inch barrel they make another banshee model with a five inch barrel or the carbines which is the resolute line has a 16 inch barrel still has the rip brace there and that is super nice let's go ahead and take a few shots man that is awesome now i have a sig p320 x compact and here's the mag here this has 15 rounds the one i just showed you had to come from the X5 because that has 21 rounds and that's what it ships with. But this is a 15 round mag from my 6 hour P320 X Compact. And the MK17 will take this no problem. Bolt locks back after the last shot. Now you can see this is a gorgeous finish on it. Just an amazing uh, silver look to it. It's actually called titanium. They offer, I believe, nine different Cerakote finishes. All right, so here we are, a 50 yard shot. On the right side is a 10 inch round target. On the left side is a 12 inch square target. Let's see how the Banshee does. The overall length is just over 24 inches with the brace fully collapsed, but this is a rip brace from CMMG. It allows the shooter to preset their length of pull position, then all they have to do is rip it out to that point very quick. Right there it says fast back. That refers to the track underneath the buffer tube with angle cuts that allow the rip brace to deploy so quickly. Magpul MOE grip, CMMG single stage trigger, 21 round P320 mag, had to come from the X5 models. Here we have a M-Lock aluminum handguard, okay, rail all the way up top here. And then the brake here is a CMMG SV brake, disperses the gases which will reduce the muzzle rise. Additionally, the optic that I'm running is a Vortex Spitfire one power prism optic that works great with this setup and the single point sling is a Grove Tech. CMMG uses a radial delayed blowback system which softens the shot 
quite a bit. There's just a slight delay from when the shot is taken to when the bolt actually goes back into the buffer. You can hardly feel it. Now, the 9mm, it's not that important, although this does have the delayed blowback system, but I really feel it with my 300 Blackout Banshee. The optic that I have here is the Vortex Spitfire AR. It is a prism optic. Let's go ahead and take a few shots here. Yeah, it's really nice. You can hardly even feel it. So there it is, a CMMG Banshee MK17 with the 8-inch barrel. They also make it with a 5-inch barrel or the CMMG Resolute Carbine in a 16-inch barrel. And I've taken this to four or five separate ranges. I put a ton of rounds through it. It's performed great. Everything from steel case to brass, you name it. It's ran outstanding and I'm very excited about it. I think it's an outstanding firearm and I look forward to spending a lot of quality time, range time, with this CMMG Banshee MK17. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.